Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Scorpio. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Um, I just had three cards fall right out, right out before I even got to shuffle them. They're upright too, so I'm going to take them. But anyhow, um, there could be a falling out. There could be. And I say that because I, I started to do your reading a minute ago and I had to do it over because I started to get frustrated. I started to get frustrated immediately. And um, so I think there's going to be, there's something that is going to be happening that is very frustrating. There's going to be a fallout of some sort. Um, and I was frustrated because I got some comments, or oh, you forgot Scorpio, or when are you going to do Scorpio? I didn't forget Scorpio. I didn't, I don't forget any sign. Timing is everything. And for those of you that don't understand that, you're not awoken, okay? Divine timing, okay? If you don't know what it is, I suggest you, you start working on that. I know that there's a lot of you that waited patiently and didn't say a word. You are the ones that understand. Shield. You need to defend yourself. You're going to need to protect yourself in some way. Boot. Increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals. You need to increase some efforts. Pig, beware of greed. So somebody needs to beware of greed. Obviously, we have somebody here that is very, very greedy. You probably need to defend yourself from this person. You need to increase your efforts. Hmm. What do we have for Scorpio? You may need, whenever I see that boot in that card, these boots were made for walking. That's what I, that's what I see. What do we have for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? You need to defend yourself. What do we have for Scorpio? Ooh. It's reversed. I don't even want to show it to you because some of you are not going to like it and you're going to get, it's going to be a huge trigger for you. Phoenix rising from the ashes in reversed. So I would say something is about to go down. It's going to be life changing. I would consider this a tower moment. Mm. But this is life changing. It's a time of transformation. It's like a it's like the death of a situation. Something needs to end so that you can rise, so that you can have something better, so that you can rebuild. It's like it's like when the hurricane or the tornado comes in and cleans something out and you are forced to be re rebuild. You this is definitely like a tower moment. There's no doubt about it. You are going to rise. You're going to rise from something. But it comes after. It comes after a fall. I know there's going to be a fall. Or a fall out. And you're going to be down. It's like down, down, down. You're going to have to pick yourself up and start over and rebuild. And it's going to, it's going to be beautiful. Your, your re, whatever it is that you're rebuilding is going to be so much more beautiful than where you are at. Bad advice from a friend or family member. Oh, I gotta show you what's on the bottom. 
emotional outburst ahead so there is an emotional outburst ahead you've received some bad advice from somebody now you're gonna have to protect yourself don't listen to this person you need to protect yourself I feel like it's it's some sort of friend or it could be a family member somebody has led you in the wrong direction I feel like you fell for it You definitely need to wear a shield. You need to protect yourself. I feel like you have an enemy. What I saw a minute ago was the Knight of Swords. I feel like it's an enemy under attack. Somebody rushing in. This person is on a mission. They've been told to do something or they're going to do something that, you know, maybe they told themselves to do it, you know. Emotional outburst ahead. You need to protect yourself. What do we have? Could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Bad advice from this person. Doesn't have to be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Could be anybody. There is somebody that is about to take action. And I don't know if they're taking action towards you. That's what I think. That's why you need to wear a shield. You need to protect yourself. Somebody is coming towards you very, very fast. They are on a mission. Finances and career, financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. So something about your career, something about your finances, this may have to do with a job or something like that. Or money, it has to do with money. There is greed here. Somebody has made a poor decision. I feel like you need to get prepared for some sort of arrival or some sort of argument because there's going to be some a fallout of some sort. Could be a fight over money. Look at that getting blurry. Why is that getting blurry? Something needs to be cleared up. There's been a haze. There's been something that has been unclear. It's about to get cleared up. But it's not going to be pretty. It's not going to be pretty with that phoenix rising going down. It's like something is about to go down. It is life changing. Trust me, it is. It's big. Six of Wands reversed. This is a loss. What's that? I have never had that happen before. <laughs> Anyhow, this is a loss of some sort. No victory. It's not over. The bat. This is a loss. This is. Uh, losing we have, we have a very uh, well usually that's like a loser it's a losing ace of cups in the middle upright so ace of cups that's a, that's a new start things that's a healing love it's an emotional it's very very emotional a new beginning Five of Wands, so that is a power struggle. Competition. Competition. There's some sort of competition here. Losing to the competition. Something about losing to the competition. The emotions all over the place. A flood of emotion. There is going to be a flood of emotion here. Emotion, emotional overload. We do have a new beginning that is coming, but there's going to be a battle. There is going to be a battle. The Five of Wands is a battle. There's some sort of competition. This is fighting to win, but there's a loss here. Seven of Swords. Cheating. Cheating. There's cheating. Somebody's been cheating. Or deceiving. There's deception here. Getting away with it. Look at that. Sorry. Sorry. Anyhow, it happens all the time. Um, 
there's some sort of deception here. This is a, this is a, no, no, you can't cheat. No, 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 no. Because it's a six of, six of wands, the seven of swords, right, together. So the seven of swords, that's deception. It's lies. It's sneaky, shady behavior. We have some sort of observing that is going on. Time of reflection. Uh intuitive very 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 intuitive secret somebody's been keeping a secret six of pentacles reversed that is being taken away somebody could be is getting taken away there is greed this is an injustice it isn't fair it's not fair. This is very extremely emotional. This is not going in the right direction. Six, two sixes reversed. That's, that's like unhealthy. It's very, very troubled. This is unbalanced. It's not fair. There's, there's a theft. There's a theft. There's stealing. Somebody has stolen something. I don't know if they stole something. They're about to get caught. There's going to be an, there's going to be some sort of struggle. Get prepared for a struggle. We have somebody here that, um, has taken something that isn't theirs. They've abused generosity. There's an abuse of generosity here. There's an abuse of, of, uh, wow, well, it's like, it's an abuse of power. It is an abuse of power. But that six of wands reversed. We were a very prideful, smug, cocky individual who, um, has cheated they have cheated they have lied they are sitting on a high horse they've gotten away with it something is about to be taken away there's, there's somebody could get fired this could have to do with a job the six of pentacles reverse this is like losing definitely losing somebody is losing they're losing a battle it's going to be extremely emotional this is a serious power struggle. There's a lot of competition here. Somebody has taken something that isn't theirs. Ooh, high priestess reverse now, unaware. Lack of awareness, a secret is about to be revealed. There is a secret that is about to be revealed about some sort of competition that you're in or fight that you've been dealing with i don't think it's over yet this battle isn't over the fight isn't over get prepared get prepared for a battle get prepared for a fight because it's not over yet you may be unaware you may think that it's over it ain't over it ain't over somebody is coming back around it's not over yet okay six of wands reverse that is no victory it is a loss this battle isn't over we have this is somebody that uh is very very smug that that uses emotions this is emotions they they play on your emotions because the five of wands is playing and then the ace of cups is playing somebody plays on your emotions you may need to tell them no. The six of wands reverse is a no. I'm not playing. There's some sort of deception here. You're not getting what you deserve. Or somebody's not getting what they deserve. The six of pentacles reverse. There's, there's a lack of reciprocation. There's one-sidedness. There's no equality. There's a lack of respect for others here as well. We have an individual here that is not very intuitive, that isn't very aware, and may have received poor advice from a tarot reader or a medium or a psychic, you know, or they've relied too much on that advice instead of listening to their own gut, you know, or, or, or instead of accepting some sort of truth. There's poor, there's poor advice here. There absolutely is. To keep holding on. Somebody has received poor advice to keep holding on. Oh, it makes me sick. You need to stop doing something. You need to stop. You need to put a stop to something. There is an emotional outburst ahead. I'm positive. 
I feel like there's going to be a fight. You're going to get in a fight with somebody. Get prepared for a battle. You it, it Definitely, I think that you are unaware. You may think that something is over. You may think that, I don't know, if somebody thinks that they won. Mm -mm. Seven of Swords, that is cheating. It is deception. It is lies. We have a very cunning, clever individual here who thinks that they're getting away with it, but they aren't. Some sort of truth is about to come out and the situation is going to come to an end. Page of Pentacles reversed. Five of Swords reversed. And Four of Wands reversed. So that is uh, uprooting, being uprooted. Uh, there's some sort of being uprooted here. Change in the living situation. Foundation, unstable foundation, not, not solid. Uh, lack of commitment. A need to walk away, a need to uh, stop investing in a one-sided situation where you're not getting what you deserve. I feel like you're dealing with people that don't see eye to eye with you. This isn't fun. It's This party is over. It's, it's time to go. It's time to stop playing this game. You're playing some game with somebody. I feel like you, you're definitely struggling. Uh, we have a serious struggle. I feel like we have a hostile situation here that is about to unfold. There could be a fight over money or fight over a job or fight over a partnership. We, we have somebody here that is unaware of the truth because they've been fed some sort of, I feel like it's illusion by, I don't know, unfortunately. Page of Pentacles reversed. This isn't solid. This is a dead end. This is... This is giving up. It's you know. I feel like you're dealing with somebody that uh, is lazy. They are complacent. You have lost sight of your focus. You're dealing with somebody that is unfaithful. They lie. They cheat. There's deception here, and you may. I don't know if there's denial. It feels like there's denial. There's a need to come out of denial. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. I feel like uh, there's a, you're dealing with somebody who doesn't care who they hurt as long as they win or somebody has won, you know, because the Five of Swords is about winning and so isn't the Six of Wands and so isn't the Five of Wands, so isn't the Seven of We got a lot. I want to win. I want to win at all costs. I don't care who I hurt. There's no moral conscience here. You know, as long as I win, I feel like you need to walk away. You need to stop playing this game. You need to stop fighting. You need to you need to remove yourself from the situation. It's gonna you need you do because there's gonna be a fallout with that phoenix rising going down. This is like this is it. This is this is it. This is this is this is it. Okay, this is the death of a situation. This is it. Um, this is the end of a commitment that you have been in that you have been holding on to for because you have lost sight of your goal you've lost you've lost your focus you've been ungrounded you've been you've been too emotional you've been you haven't been very grounded there's a lack of groundedness here there is there's there's uh, a lot of fighting going on engaging in the competition you know i feel like you are unaware that there is going to be some sort of um uprooting in some way okay um There's going to be some sort of serious fight. Serious, hostile situation. It's very, very extremely emotional. It's going to really put you in your feelings. There's lies, there's deception, there's cheating, stealing, theft. Somebody stole something and they're, and the secret is coming out, you know, or they lied about something. There's unfaithfulness here. 
lack of loyalty and you keep holding on, you keep holding on, let go. You need to let go. You need to wake up. The high priestess reverse is lack of awakening, refusing to refusing to see or to, to listen. I feel like some of you have received some bad advice and you're going with that about a commitment, something that you are committed to. You really need to let go. You're only hurting yourself. You're engaged in some sort of game. It's like you're playing some sort of game. Get out of it. It's like it is the game of love. We got the five of wands and the ace of cups. That is the game of love. You're playing, but this is a loss. This is losing that game. It's losing the game. You need to wake up. You need to walk away. You need to. I know that you do. I know that you do. This is this is um some sort of disgrace this is a disgrace it's a loss it's a disgrace it's embarrassing i feel like you need to let something go page of pentacles reverse next to the five is just walk away next to the five of swords reverse stop you're hurting yourself you're only hurting yourself by not accepting the truth you need to accept the truth some sort of truth is going to come out that is going to shake up your foundation or your commitment and this may have to do with a job. It may be at your work. If this is a work situation, this is a major loss as far as I'm concerned. There is some lies that are about to be revealed. You're dealing with somebody that lies to you a lot. This person doesn't care who they hurt. They really, really don't. As long as they can have their cake and eat it too. You know, they just they just want to be the winner. They just want to be the winner. They want to they want to have all the attention. This is an attention seeking individual. Somebody that likes to be in the spotlight but doesn't have the experience to be in the spotlight. They should they're in a leadership position. They they you've given them or they we have somebody here that is in a leadership position that doesn't have the experience to be in the leadership position. Six of Wands reversed. It's like they've been put in the position, but they don't have the experience to be put in the position. And they're losing, or they lost, or they're losing. This is a loss. Cheating, deception. Six of Pentacles reversed. That is being taken away, given to somebody else totally unaware this is a big huge battle you're this battle isn't over get prepared to deal with whatever this is this week it's not over yet something is coming back around what goes around comes around something is coming back around to be dealt with i think that you are completely unaware of it there's probably going to be an upcoming get-together that is totally, totally unexpected. Anyhow, my advice is, or what I got to say is get prepared to deal with some drama this week. There's going to be some drama on the home front or drama in the work situation. There's going to be a huge fight. We have a very cocky, egotistical individual that... I don't know, has cheated, lied, stolen something. And I feel like I feel like there's something that isn't what's going to happen with this individual that has deceived that is very this person has no staying power. They don't have the experience. They're very, very. Uh, I feel like you're dealing with somebody that is very abusive. I feel like they're mentally abusive. There's mental abuse here. Three of Cups. You're going to need to be strong. Sit strength on the bottom, which is strong, courage, confidence, willpower, discipline, healing, get together, 
getting together, socializing. Somebody, I feel like there's cheating going on. Maybe socializing on social media, doing something, celebrating, living, living. Somebody's been overspending or they've been really just, they've been celebrating a win that they didn't win. Sorry. There is going to be an upcoming get together. Somebody is getting together with somebody that, and it's going to cause a fight. It is going to definitely, they're going to be socialized. Somebody's going to, I don't know if they're going to get caught communicating with somebody on social media. We definitely have a third party situation here where there's some sort of deception. And this is a loss. It is a loss. And there is going to be, you know, for the, we have an, a get together twice. You're going to need to restrain yourself. You are going to need to restrain yourself in some way. You need to stop giving to somebody or somebody, somebody here needs to stop giving. They need to stop deceiving themselves. They need to wake up. And I feel like you've reached a point where it's just like, you got to say no. You may be approached by somebody who doesn't care if they hurt you. Maybe they're not getting attention from somebody else, you know. They want to get together with you. Say no. This isn't, No. And you may think this person plays on your emotions. The, the five of wands next to the eight, they play on your emotions. Maybe, you know, sometimes people are like, well, you love me. I can take advantage of you. I can hurt you. I can step on you. I can walk all over you. I can disrespect you. I can, I can take from you because you are, you are, you're not awoken. The high priestess reverse, you know, you're, you, you don't see it clearly. You think I'm going to give you commitment when, you know, <laughs> Because you're, you know, in your love with me. Anyhow, I'm just saying. So I think that you got somebody here that is going to be. Uh, this is somebody that is deceptive. They cheat. They lie. They aren't. They don't tell the truth. They think that they're coming back around. They want to play with you, but that's all it is. This is this is no staying power. Get prepared to. Uh, protect yourself from somebody. This person may pretend to be your friend. They, this could be an enemy disguised as a friend. I would say uh, expect the unexpected. Somebody wants to get together with you or something like that. Or you're going to be dealing with some sort of serious situation with an individual that you live with that causes a huge... You're going to be struggling. You're, this is definitely a struggle. There's going to be a fallout. Good luck.